Another day, another VTuber shows their true colors. This is why VTubers kind of have a bad rep. Because it's people that hide their face and their identity behind an avatar. And then they think they can get away with doing stuff like this VTuber did. After School Sophie is a Tekken VTuber, for those of you who don't know. I actually entered one of her tournaments she hosted a few months ago, back when Tekken 8 first released. Um, and just the other day, it started out by someone going into her stream, and all of a sudden just saying the N-word, and just going on a tirade of racial slurs, and, uh, uh yeah, I think with recently what happened in the election, we're going to see a lot more of this, unfortunately, in the uh, FGC. And just and if you know, the FGC doesn't stand for that kind of stuff. It's probably one of the most diverse communities out there when it comes to the uh, community. Um, there's a lot of trans, gay, people of color, um, people from all over the world that are involved in the community. So, people don't tolerate this stuff. Here's a clip of someone in her chat explaining, Hey, if you're not in this minority, you shouldn't be saying these things. And she's like, why not? It's just baffling to me how ignorant people can be. Um, and there's a tweet, uh, Speed Kicks tweeted out, I will mention uh, more towards the end of the video. Uh, but yeah, here's the clip. It's because you aren't from the culture, it's like how if you aren't gay, you can't use homophobic stereotypes or slurs. If you are Mexican, you can't use Mexican slurs. Why not? Like, literally people were telling me just to say like, all sorts of slurs just earlier, and it's like... I, I feel like there's people that don't get offended with those slurs anyway. Fuck, is it a slur? Okay, so it's only slurs? Is that what it is? That's an insult com compared to a literal slur. Okay. X. Okay, so basically if I see. Yeah. Okay, F slur is the closest. It's not even close. <laughs> like. Oh. <laughs> I have no words. I just. I, I'm, I, I don't find this funny. It's just the whole vibe of it. Like, the music playing, her high-pitched voice, her trying to justify saying these things. You just can't help but to laugh at it sometimes because it's just so mind-boggling. People will go out in the open and say these things. What's wrong with you people? Like, especially in, if you're in the FGC, why are you going around thinking it's okay to sling around these words? And she's saying it like she just fucking says it every day. No biggie. Um, but I have some more clips, and this is where it gets even worse. Um, so yeah, just a heads up, trigger warning. Um... But yeah, this, uh, p people like this need to be exposed and shown how, I wouldn't say evil, but more ignorant and dumb they are to the people around them and just how they kind of speak about them. And that's, that's not okay. But yeah, um, just fair warning, it's, it's about to get a, a little worse. We can do bonus stuff. What did he say? Damn, look at these guys. I'm probably seeing his nuts in the chat or something. Permission to copy face my shit. Now, this is where, uh, this is the kicker. She tries to go back like in it's like it's the early 2000s, maybe even the 90s, 80s, um, back when, you know, comedy, uh, they weren't afraid to say stuff. Um, doesn't matter if it was racial or what. Um, but yeah, this it's 
2024, almost 2025. People don't stand for racism anymore. I hate to break it to you. Um, but yeah, here in this next clip, uh, she kind of just like justifies it and tries to defend it, um, calling it comedy. Um, and I guess this isn't the full clip, but after she said uh, it's comedy, don't don't watch me f or whatever, like, uh, 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 huh? Like I said, it's almost 2025. People don't uh, tolerate this shit. So obviously, I'm just trying to have fun. Like, I'm just trying to say... In the same way that a comedian would say, Damn, fucking... Fuck, there's... We're fucking... Right? Like, it's meant for entertainment. Which can obviously be offensive. Um, the, the thing is, Sophie, is you're a, a VTuber. You're just some random girl on the internet that plays Tekken. You're not a... You're not a comedian. And even if you pay attention to comedy nowadays, people don't say stupid shit like this anymore. So, of course, she got banned on Twitch shortly after this. Um, hopefully it's permanent because she don't deserve to come back. Um... I do believe in second chances, just not with stuff like this. If you're going to go blurt out racial slurs and be ignorant to those around you, uh, you don't really deserve to come back and be a part of that community you once were. You just don't deserve it. Um, and as always, once someone gets banned, they come out with this chat GPT apology. Um, but in this statement, she states that she's scared like, girl, you have no, um, you know, you have no right to be scared because you're a dumbass who went out and on your own decided to say these things. You know right from wrong, so you know what you did. You deserve the consequences of your actions. Um, but yeah, uh, with the speed kicks thing, he pretty much just says, um, that she's more ignorant than, uh, you know, she is evil. The dogpiling isn't really necessary, which I, I kind of feel the opposite. I don't agree with that part. If you come out and say dumb shit, you deserve to be told that you're wrong. And I don't care how they go about it. Um, horrible people deserve to be, you know, talked down how they talk down to other people. It's, you know, whatever. That's it. Um, I just wanted to let you know about this person in the community who knows this might even you know gain her traction and more followers because of this because of just how the world is right now uh towards trans and gay people and p people of color but yeah that's it this is dark Sin signing out and i hope you take care